Now Sports with News Channel 7's Noah Manderfeld. Years of hard work have led to today, signing day. It's a busy day for our area, so I'll let News Channel 7's Ben Howick take it away on all the area Division 1 signings from local athletes. The joy of putting pen to paper. 13 area athletes signing national letters of intent for D1 schools. First huge day for DC Everest. Seven Evergreens signing. That's an impressive number, something the group hopes to build on. I think it's awesome. I think our programs are getting better and better every year. And honestly, I hope next year we have eight, and I hope it keeps getting bigger. Uh, it really sets the standard here at Everest. Uh, it shows that Wisconsin, we're a really good athletic state. I mean, a lot of people, they always sleep on Wisconsin. Cooper will be headed to Chattanooga to wrestle, while Lang Ben will play baseball at Wichita State. Also, Marisol Swenson is headed to swim at Green Bay, while David Mayer will swim at South Dakota. Blake Postler will run track at Bradley, while Jenna Bauman will become a Badger at Wisconsin. Playing soccer, another Badger is Sarah Melodic, who will run cross country and track. After dominating high school, she hopes collegiate success is next. I made it to the top of Division I cross country, um, so my goal is just to work with those around me to work my way up at the D1 level as well. Melodic getting a Badger teammate up north. Nora Gremband of Northland Pines is headed to Wisconsin, fresh off a state title in cross country. Quite the year, considering she came back from injury. I'm just so grateful. Um, obviously, I wouldn't have been able to do all of that without my coaches and my family um, and also my teammates and my friends for just always supporting me. So it's just great for everyone who showed up here today. From one state champ to another, Schwamigan cross-country runner Autumn Mikulski is headed to Oklahoma State. At SPASH, a pair of runners rushing off to D1 schools. Bodie Erickson is headed to Liberty. Aloysius Franson is off to Minnesota. The pair has helped Spash to team state titles in cross country and track this past year. Only fitting they signed together. I mean, I was having this conversation with my mom this morning. You know, there's not a lot of people that go D1, and I'm so grateful to, you know, have a best friend who's also going D1. At Mosney, Garrett Shoup will be lacing up his baseball cleats in Fargo as he signs with NDSU today. Pretty exciting day for him and his family. I've been working for this like my whole life and always wanting to go to Division I, play baseball. That's been my goal since I was really little. Since my dad went and played at Minnesota, it's always been like my goal to go and follow his footsteps and do something good in college. To a diamond by a different name, Wassa East softball star Claire Cushman stays in state to play for UWGB. This is a day of satisfaction, not just for her, but for her entire support staff. It just means so much. Like Everybody here has played a role in what I've done and what I've achieved today, and it's just great that like I can sit here and you know they can watch me, but I'm also just thanking them like for everything, for my parents and my friends and all the support. I wouldn't be here without them. Congratulations to all our D1 signings. We'll have D2 signings tonight at 10.